Good morning, everybody. Welcome to your Thursday, September 17th, Daily Devo, and day number four of looking at the great classic hymn, I Rise, My Soul Will Rise, written by Charles Wesley. Hope everyone's going to have a good day today for Thursday. And the week is flying by very fast. <laughs> but today's title is His Spirit Answers to the Blood. And we're going to be looking at verse number four of the great hymn. And today's verse is Romans 8, verse 11. It says, But if the Spirit of Him that raised up Jesus from the dead dwell in you, He that raised up Christ from the dead shall also quicken your mortal bodies by His Spirit that dwelleth in you. Amen? Excuse me. Got a little, got a little itchy on my shoulder. Last few minutes, my shoulder's been itching. So. And prior to recording this video, it is Sunday afternoon. Or Sunday. Sunday afternoon, Sunday early evening. Because it is about 5.30, after 5.30 on, me, uh, on Sunday. So I always like to do my videos in a row and then when I post them they come out every day so so the fourth verse of a of arise my soul arise speaks of God the Father answering the re request of God the Son and granting salvation to a repentant sinner adopting him into his family and the fourth verse goes the father hears him pray his dear anointed one he cannot turn away the presence of his son. His spirit answers to the blood and tells me I am born of God. Answers to the blood. I am born of God. I love the way most of these are, they rhyme a little bit. So, so as Christ the Messiah hung on Calvary's tree, God the Father turned away, unable in his holiness to look upon Christ as he bore the sins of many. Hebrews 9.28 My God, my God, why hast thou forsaken me? Psalm 22.1 He cried in his agony, but once God's righteous justice was satisfied, the Father turned back and answered Christ's prayer, even from the horns of the altar, as it were. Psalm 22.21 I and my Father are one, Christ had said, John 10, 30. And once sin's penalty was paid, there would be no more separation. Amen? So when a sinner comes to God, claiming the blood of Christ as a full payment for his sins, and Christ himself prays for the sinner's full forgiveness and acceptance, the Father cannot turn away. For in John 1 John 4.10 He loved us and sent His Son to be the appropriation for our sins. Amen? So as in today's, today's passage, Romans 8.11 The same Spirit that raised up Christ grants the spiritually dead sinner new life and declares him to be born of God. John 3.7 Marvel not that I say unto thee, Ye must be born again, literally born from above. And lastly, 1 John 3, 1. Behold what manner of love the Father hath bestowed upon us, that we should be called the sons and daughters of God. Amen? Amen? Thank you. That is all for day number four of the look at Rise My Soul Arise. Tomorrow is Friday, September the 18th. And we're going to be looking at no, verse number 5. And it'll be day number 5 of the study of the spiritual hymn, Arise My Soul, Arise. And tomorrow's title is Father, Abba, Father. And we're going to be starting with Romans chapter 8, verse 14 and 15. Be, stay tuned for that one. 
Thanks for watching. Hope everyone has a great rest of your Thursday. And prayers, love and prayers go out to all battling this hectic time that we're in right now. And just pray to God that everybody gets through this crazy, these crazy times. My heart goes out to everybody battling this. And praise the God I die. I don't not having to deal with anything. I'm basically I'm protected for some reason. So I I have breathing problems. I have lung problems. I I have a few different problems that but I guess my immune system is built up so much it it counteracts it, so I don't I don't get it so but my brother has a little a few problems my mom has a few problems my dad has a few and none of us has gotten we must be doing something right or we must be protected for some reason God has a plan for all of us if you get sick God's wanting you God is testing you God will be testing you if you get sick and you're not supposed to He's giving you a clear warning like, look, you're doing something wrong. Or if you get sick and you're not doing what you're supposed to be doing. And if you're not following his plan and he lets you get sick. That's that. That's, that is punishment for not following his plan. <laughs> you get me what I'm saying? Tell him. I hope you enjoyed that. Enjoy the rest of your rest of your Thursday. And I'll see you tomorrow. God bless you. Be safe. Be well. I appreciate you. I love you. See you tomorrow. And I'm out.